Hi guys, I'm Nagatcha, and welcome to my reaction for Chocho's Bizarre Adventure Battle Tendency Chapter... Which one chapter it was? Uh, 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 chapter... 13 or 14? Or... Where it is? Where do I have it? <laughs> I can offer a call. Chapter 13 and 14. It's kinda not that easy. So, I'm quite excited for that. I haven't read it for a while because I didn't have a time. So, I'm going to do these two chapters. And I don't know like when there would be next other chapters. But I will try because I do really like the series. It's really fun. Very enjoyable. Crazy, crazy Jojo. So, <clears throat> chapter 13 is called Jojo vs. the Ultimate Being. Okay, so I guess he will be fighting Santana. Because if I'm remembering correctly, that whatever old vampire thingy was revived by Nazis, which also ha are holding Speedwagon captive and I don't know what they are trying to do with Santana some experimentation, probably like trying to have a soldier out of him and Jojo is on his way to save Speedy Speedwagon Speedy, I mean Speedy so I wonder what will happen next I love the page, it's very purplish but also kind of a lot of colors in and here and there so it's fun so the first page ah oh, this is interesting we have all three people speedwagon Stro strohheim and jojo and like their inner thoughts speedwagon the most evolved being on earth he must not get to the outside world even if it, even if it costs my life that is my destiny since 50 years ago Oh yeah, because he and the previous JJ I like fought Dio, which he had powers of stone mask. Strawheim Lieutenant. I messed up. I figured this would help me get a promotion, but this is bad. The general will be angry. I must destroy Santana now. Damn it. He looks very stressed. Well, I'm not surprised. Because Santana just escaped through the winds alien style, so yeah, that, that would be very bad. I love how like these villains are supposed to be dangerous, but they are kind of like funny also. <coughs> <clears throat> and Jojo, huh, I don't give a damn about these Nazi experiments. I'll just save Uncle Speedwagon and make Grandma Arena happy. That's it. That's about it. I like this page. And there is like Santana's eyes sulking at the bottom. Okay. So, um, yep. Nazis are kinda... I guess... <laughs> they're having a problem. 
the man in the column santana just called you by your name lieutenant strawheim did he hear it through the air wind maybe he also escaped through it i guess you are fracked guys seriously fracked i think this is a time where you should start panicking oh my god what is this i like in some some very huge room i miss it few times before what are those machines blimps or just like some fighting machines because i see something like legs star wars reference okay we have a detailed thing at a uh, air ventilation yeah because they have a doors and also air ventilation here and there oh god is it connected to this room? Hey you, don't stand near the wind, it's dangerous. <laughs> oh my god, is this Strawheim or Arnold guy? I kinda can't differentiate. I don't know, he's also blondie. Maybe. I mean, you just witnessed that it probably heard you from winds and this guy standing near it. Oh my god, how could you? Yep, it sees him. And, oh wow, it did something to his head. Well, this guy's dead. It went out, kinda distorted. I mean, it doesn't look like human, but like some weird meaty cube of whatever the frick it is. It went right into his head, so he's probably going to absorb him. Yeah. It went into him? What is it doing? It's creepy. It's probably inside him. <laughs> and that's just like, oh, is it him? Santana? They're panicking. <laughs> One is like, what? <laughs> I love this guy. What are we doing? <clears throat> yeah, they're like watching him. The guy turn around. It's like, did something happen, Lieutenant Strohheim? It's dark, can't see anything. Why did you turn all the lights? <laughs> A speedbag is like, he did when the soldier's body, he's sweating like freak. Wow, so he went into him. He, like, his eyes is completely gone. He don't know what's happening. Where is everyone? Don't leave me alone. <laughs> Other guys are like panicking, like, um, we are keeping distance, guy, man. And they are making noise, like, that's too bad. And now his body is expanding. Like, rapidly expanding. I don't understand, but I haven't felt this fresh in a long time. What the hell is happening to him? It's like being transformed. Unbelievable. If he gets out, he'll be a large threat to our country. He must be killed. We must destroy him here. It's okay, kill him. Shoot through the soldier's body. They're still kind of panicking, but they're shooting. So, the last thing is like... The... Soldier talking? Because this fresh in a long time. Or is it Santana? Can't tell. <laughs> yeah, so... They're still shooting at him. Oh my god, there are so many bullet holes. And he's spraying blood. <laughs> he he that tickles. He he is alive, as I thought. Machine guns can kill him. Wow, he's like crawling towards them. <clears throat> <clears throat> what is it doing? That's creepy. Like his part of his head, where like his eyes are, is gone. There's like one eyeball. That looks creepy. You know, he's pointing. What's with the finger position? I don't know. Maybe he will shoot through it. I mean, I see someone shooting from the air, so I can believe everything. What does that mean? That you are dead? Wait, is that supposed to be a gun? The finger pose is like a gun. Is he copying us? He only said my name earlier. He just said my name like a parrot. He's just copying. There's no meaning. Just imitating us like a monkey. Could he be... Again, Strawheim, you're stupid. His intelligence is low. If his intelligence is at the level of a monkey, then 
we humans will be able to use him. But if he is able to like learn extremely fast, he might be able to kill you pretty quickly. Wow, and now the guy's opening his mouth way beyond his limit. Yeah, that looks hurtful. Was it you guys who disturbed my sleep? So he's probably inside of him and talking through him. Why is he? What? And his lover, his chin, well. Kind of fall off. Well, not chin, lower part of a. How is it called in the English? Huh. Yeah, I can remember. Well, damn. It fell down. He talked. His intelligence isn't low. He has an amazing brain. He'll learn our language in that short amount of time. He had calculated his escape. Finally, somebody with a brain speed wagon. Good lord for him. <clears throat> Die. He's still pointing at them. What is it doing? Something with his skin? Is it like coming through the guy? It looks like the guy's skin is falling apart. Yeah, I mean, he'll learn their language and he's just trying to imitate them. Like, I mean, he was sleeping who knows for long, thousands of years, so... Of course, imitating, imitating is a good way how to understand something you don't. Yeah, the skin of the guy he's in is coming up and he's shooting at them. Yeah, as a finger pistol. Oh, God. And looks like the not just one bullet, but three at once. Does it bounce? I don't understand. I mean, he was shot at, so he might like take the bullets inside of him and shoot them. The guys are again panicking. Oh, he collected the bullets we shot into him and shot them back at us. You know what I basically said? It's kind of creepy seeing this guy. He's inside kind of melting and like... Ugh, he looks like plop. It's disturbing. Speedwagon and then sweating as hell. Hey, old man, watch out. Hide over here. Oh, wow, this soldier is kind of mindful. I like him. Oh, is it Jojo? He's gonna shoot all of these bullets back this way. Get lost. I don't want help from a Nazi. He's like, get away from me. Oh, yeah, it's Jojo. I was like, and then I noticed like he has a purple hair and like his specific chin. I'm like, wait a minute. Jeez. Just like always, still a stubborn old man in a situation like this. Yeah, it's Jojo. Yeah, and our baddy Santana just ripped his himself out of his dead guy. I must say he looks cool. Like, he looks cool. Magnificent. Love his hair. Oh my god, he's a, he has better hair than me. What the frick? And a body though, oh my god. Holy frickles. Oh, there's nothing we can do. Stram is panic and it looks funny. Oh, hey, I'm gonna take some of your hair. Well, more than just some. <laughs> Jojo is just like catching him by his hair and just ripping it off. Oh, what are you doing? Do you realize I'm your superior officer? It'll only hurt for a sec. <clears throat> oh my god, he take a lot of hair. Poor guy is going to be bald. Who is that? It personally, could it be? I still didn't notice it's Jojo. I mean, it's, he has the same voice. But yeah, he needs... Is he like probably going to shoot at him with the hair? Like, you know, can you harden hair by ripple? I, I guess. Yeah, because Santana is probably attacking. Yeah, it looks like he's putting ripple. Yeah. I called it ripple hair attack. Yeah, he's putting ripple in hair. And it's spiky. 
like cactus spikes. Looks really fancy. <clears throat> oh wow, it looks like judges are uh, is all spiky. Electricity? Kinda looks like. You know, static electricity. And we are speaking of static electricity, somehow I'm producing a hell lot of it. And you, like always when I'm at my work and I touch something like metally, I just give myself a small shock. And it pisses me off. And usually when I like wash myself in the water, my hands just like, <laughs> like I'm sparking. Am I Pikachu or what the hell? Static electricity. Never thought it would be so annoying. <laughs> like seriously, it's horrible. I don't know. Is it? Is it like the I don't know sweaters I wear or what the hell? Why I have so much static electricity in me? That's not normal. I can't even work, I touch thing metal, and there is a lot of metal things, and I just shock myself a tiny bit. Once there was a new sparkle. <sighs> Do someone has this kind of problem? Please tell me. <laughs> so yeah. Oh, you are you are Joseph Joestar. Oh wow, he looks cool with his spiky hair. I guess it's static electricity looks like. <clears throat> Maybe I should learn that. <laughs> so what is he doing? Looks like Santana shoot a bullets at them. Nazis are dying. And Jojo is like reflecting that by his by the hair floating in the air. Spiky hair floating in the air. It looks cool in that Nazi uniform though. Yeah, soldiers are dead. Strawham also is alive because he was just behind Jojo <laughs> covering. Like, this guy looks strong, I'm just gonna be here. I guess it's Strawham. Did he just put his hat on? Probably because he don't want, see he don't want anyone to see the bald part. Of his head because Jojo put so much hair of it. <clears throat> okay, what is Santana doing? These hairs seem a bit dry. You better take care of your hair or you'll go well, Nazi guy. Well, he don't need to if you just like take a bunch of them out of him. <laughs> when did you get here? Speedwagon is like so shocked. Ah, Santana is looking at what he did. Hair. Ah, oh, he's looking at it. But you know, looks like I stumbled into one hell of a killing field. I guess. What is it doing? He's like looking at a hair and. Like, hmm, interesting thing. Hmm, how can I do it? Hmm. Jojo, don't give this guy an idea. Because it might get even stronger. So this is the end. That, that went pretty quick. I love the imagery. Amazing as always. Um, bloody imagery is also amazing. I mean, if I wouldn't went through a lot of seinen manga... I would be probably kind of disturbed, and yeah, I'm sometimes still disturbed because the author draws um, bodily parts being twisted pretty nicely or being cut very detailedly, so yeah. But hey, I I've read Berserk and others, so I'm okay. That's not even like the worst bodily horror I've ever watched, read, I mean... Junji Ito and Spir Spiral has pretty a lot of body horror. And Gyo is kind of disgusting too. It's more disgusting when I say body horror. I love body horror. Right, plenty a lot of things. And in worst case scenario, it's kind of a little bit disgusting. So, out of chapter <clears throat> 14th? Yeah. 
It's called the Ripple and the Ultimate Life Form. Okay. And we have a judge on some fancy dress with so many fancy accessories. Like, seriously, this author loves to draw sparkly things. So, what happened next? We can let him get out. Yeah, we're still at the base. He most likely created the stone masks. That's possible. Was it a tool to increase his food supply and take over the world? I don't know. You need to ask him. And according to the writings on the wall, he is weak to the energy of the sun. Ripple energy. And was just awakened for thousands of years sleep. Yeah, we know all of that. Good for you to rem remembering me. So yeah, we have like this nice picture of the room they are in. And like Jeji on one side, Santana on the other side. Also Strawham with Speedwagon just looking kinda surprising. Jojo, the energy of the ripple is the energy of the sun. You must kill Santana. I guess that's Speedwagon shouting. Well, duh. <clears throat> I'm not even using ripple and I know that. What the hell is that? <clears throat> what the hell is that address under Jojo's Nazi's uniform? <laughs> what is that? It's cool. I look cool looking though. Oh yeah, Jojo is like standing there and thinking, looking directly at Santana. Santana looking directly at him. Is this a staring contest? Hey, this one seems male, but are there females? How do how do they make what? How do they make kids? I guess. What is this? What are you interested into? I don't want to know. I mean, I don't need female. I have a male, pretty good looking. He has nice butt. Not complaining. What was going on thousands of years before he went to sleep? You can imagine. I can. I wasn't there. Yeah, Jojo has pretty nice clothes underneath it. He looks kind of like a mix of ninja or something. Well, Santana doesn't buy it. He is so... So... <laughs> stern looking. Be careful, Jojo. Be careful. Well, Santana is staring him down. He's like, I do not like this guy. Jojo is like, slowly, slowly, touched ya. And it's just backing up. Santana doesn't give a shit. Don't provoke him. You are speaking only, right? Happy? Joey P? Nice to meet you, P? Hello, how are you doing? Oh my god, Jojo. Yeah, I went nuts, guys, surprised. Like, what the hell is this guy doing? What the hell? He's singing some weird song. Santana, join in. One, two, three. Nice to meet you, Pi. Nice to meet you, Pi. <laughs> yeah. Speedwagon's like, Jojo, what the hell are you doing? Can you please tell this is serious? Well, I was thinking he might be a good guy. I was just chicken. I think it's wrong when you encounter Big Food or Nessie and just assume they're bad. Don't be foolish. He has killed many of my men. Well, he was captured by you. He probably didn't like it. And you weren't nice to him. <laughs> Jojo is like, shut up, you were the one who started it. Experimenting, using machine guns, that's what, that's why that happened to you. Plus, I came here to take Speedwagon back to New York with me. There's no reason to fight him. I'm not that sure about it. Now with me, happy, joy, P. nice to meet you, P. Pi, uh, I don't know. Yeah, it's just goofing around and Santana is doing some weird moves. Did he just walk past him? What's this? He's totally ignoring me. That pisses me off, a tad. 
all right, I'll get a reaction out of him. So he's like trying to kick him. In the leg? Yeah. I'll trip him with my leg. And she, he just phased through him. And she's just like, what? Or he just like, I don't know. Did something weird with his leg. It looked like he phased through, but he probably, I don't know, did something weird. I don't know. I don't know what kind of weird magic he's using, but he's cool. He faced through him and it, and just took his freaking shoe. What kind of magic trick is this? I wanna know, please. <laughs> just like, what, what just happened? What was the feeling? He stole their freaking shoe, but be glad that he didn't like get inside of you and I don't know, kill you. Oh, he went for a gun. Hmm. First time seeing this. Never seen this. What is this tool? It's a gun. Machine gun. Good gun. Lot of killing. Very fast. I mean, yeah, he is interested. He spoke. He does understand. Somehow he completely mastered our language. Very clever man. What is it doing? I just like took the gun apart pretty quickly, actually. Wow, he took the gun apart accurately like clockwork. <laughs> and now the guy's like, that takes hours of training to learn. Meaning he has an amazing mind. Yeah, that means that <clears throat> he understands things pretty quickly. I mean, we don't know how old he is before he went to sleep. So he probably gained some knowledge, a lot of knowledge. And he probably like has a good creativity mind, so we can look at things and just know how he should be able to take them apart, I guess. <clears throat> and he's now looking at a light. Bright, what is this light? This light too. Never seen it before. We weren't the ones examining him. It was the opposite. Hey you, if you understand the language, then respond. JJ is still like poking him with a helmet. <laughs> He's so stupid. What the hell are you? Watch out, Jojo. Stop freaking touching him. Even now he's like annoying primitive being. <laughs> I like that. He calls him primitive because we don't know how old how old he is. He might be ten thousands of years old. Who knows? And even though he slept for a long time, like, he probably seen so many, like, cultures dying off and being replaced and seeing a lot of new stuff here and then, so he can understand things pretty easily. What is it doing with his freaking rib cage? <laughs> oh no, it just looks like... <laughs> No, I hate it when his rib cage just like went out from him. It looks like those like legs on a freaking stone makes. I don't like it. I don't like it. Too much like face hugger. I don't like it. I mean, I don't mind spiders or crabs. They have these like kind of small legs, but this is creepy. <clears throat> so yeah, he's using his freaking ribs extending them i mean it's good because it's going for his back like in his back so he can like attack people at his back he's like oh what is this yeah and he's using his ripple to stop that wow it looks amazing kind of ribs blade each one can go in any direction maximum length 133 centimeters? What? That's a lot. Yeah, it looks like blades from this perspective. Yeah, this looks better. 
from a side and from like <clears throat> up look maximum strength is 825 kilograms per on centimeter <laughs> are you freaking kidding me well youch good lord that Jojo is using his ripple or he would be shredded to mincemeat oh but he got kind of slashed Jojo be careful and he's like, no, he wasn't backing away. He was just pushed. Oh my god. And pretty heavily. He just destroyed some metal panel or whatever the hell it is. And he's slightly bleeding. Well, now he's bleeding more. It must, And he's falling down and hitting himself again. Well, youch. Fire flower? What is this human? Yeah, and Satana is just looking behind him. Probably he saw the ripple thing. So he's kinda surprised. And we have a shot at his booty again. I like that booty. He was blasted away, then absorbed into me. The leg I touched earlier seemed fine too. I have never met a human like this. Is this man special? Or... Are all humans like that in this era? <laughs> He's just like standing and thinking, hmm, this is interesting. I wonder. I like him, I like him. I like him. He's just interested. And now he's walking to Speedwagon. I don't like it. Oh, he's putting his finger into Speedwagon. I don't like it even more. I mean, so he can face through people. Don't know what he can do to them. Probably kill them. Also not, as we've seen. I like these horns. He looks so cool. Hmm, as I thought, that man is special. Jojo, scary. He still has his freaking hand in inside of Speedwagon's head. I don't like it. Oh, Jojo looks pissed. Uncle. He is bleeding. He got cut on the nose. Right. Kind of very close to eye. He's very pissed. Don't tell me Speedwagon is going to die now again. <laughs> you bastard, get away from him. I want to fight you now. I'll put you in a museum. Have humans evolved a bit? Well, now I wonder how old he is because he seems kind of interested in humans. <laughs> evolved a bit when I was sleeping just for a few thousands of years. Like, pff, nah. So, I'm guessing he's alien. He's talking about humans. He has horns. Maybe he just happened to kind of evolve or absorb humans so he looks like one of them now. I don't know. Jaja is rushing at him. You bastard. Looks like he's going to, I don't know, punch him in the face. I'll blast you with a ripple. Yeah, he's using ripple. Again, with his punch. But the freaking guy just absorbed his freaking hand. What? The ripple doesn't work? Well, shit. Oh no, this isn't about war now. This is... This world is finished. Isn't that Speedwagon? Don't be so depressing, man. Well, yeah, because... I'm like, this man is very... <gasps> very strong and I don't know how the hell did he got in that column who did that to him he referred to, referred to it as sleeping no no maybe he was just bored <laughs> so he went sleeping in the column like no big deal and his like weakness is sunlight like a vampire and it should be Ripple, but like Ripple doesn't hurt him at all because he's using his weird powers. Is he like making, I don't know, part of the people's body his body or what is he doing? He doesn't look face, so if only weapon they have against him doesn't work, it looks pretty bad, yeah. But <clears throat> this is... Hmm, it may be not Speedwagon, it's probably that Nazi guy. Yeah, he's talking about war. Well, it's 
But you did that, Strawheim. You should pay for it. Like, seriously, man. That's what you get if you are too curious and sticking your nose where you shouldn't. Seriously, good lord that I have a good sense of not sticking my nose to dangerous things. Because I'm survivalist. I would be like, no, nope, I'm getting the fuck out of here. So this is the end of the chapter, and it was kind of cool, <laughs> Goofy Jojo, like, oh my god, man, seriously, you're just annoying him, he's going to kill you. Maybe he he would be interested enough not to kill you, but I'm not that sure about it. Not that sure about it. <laughs> I just love how phased he is with everything, like, what is this? It looks so interesting, this light, I don't know what. Hmm, are the humans evolve a bit? Hmm, what is this thing? This machine? Interesting. <laughs> it's kind of funny that Strahan was calling him primitive. Because he wasn't talking and much responding. But, <laughs> like, Sathamon was like... Those are nine primitives. Oh my god, can they stop, please? So, is like Santana going to be a final villain of this? Because if so, I like it. I like him a lot. He's very interesting. Very, very interesting. He has interesting personality, interesting powers. Yeah, so I think I will give these chapters previous one probably 8 out of 10, but this one 9 out of 10. There is nothing better than making fun of whoever, and Santana is very interesting. I do really like him. So, yeah. I wonder what will happen. I'm, and that booty, like, come on. Seriously. He has amazing booty. <laughs> Some fun service for me. I mean, a lot of guys here have nice booties. So, <laughs> I wonder how will they be able to, like, kill him, finish him off, defeat him, if Ripple doesn't work. That's kinda bad. Kinda funnily bad. I guess there would be some trick to it. But I don't know which. Or maybe JJ just needs to expand his ripple. Like, <clears throat> learn more techniques or whatever. Master it more. I just don't know. Because I guess, like, he has it naturally. Maybe Speedwagon, like, told him a few things about it. But I don't know if he, like... Well, that was straight. He might have, like... Taught him something. But I don't know. Straight's gonna turn into... Douchey idiot. At the end. So, I don't know. Yeah, it's like, so this chapter was really good. I really like it. And I left Santana already. I mean, I liked him when he firstly appeared. He looks so interesting. Strahan, Nazi guy, is probably just comedic relief at this point. <laughs> it's funny. Those Nazis are really funny. I mean, usually you don't see, like, Nazis as comedic relief. I'm not against that. I like it. <clears throat> There might be kind of like brutally killed and so on here, but yeah, they're a pretty fun, fun part of this manga. So yeah, that's all. I wonder what will happen next. This is bad situation. Worst of the worst. We'll see if Jojo will come to some plan to escape or to attack. Yep, we'll see.
So I think I think that's all. So goodbye and see you next time.